And here we are back in the beautiful St. Ives, 16 years later, and still looking as beautiful as ever. All those little alleyways have all those little secrets. Here you have the quintessential vista of St. Ives. It's looking rather splendid on this sunny autumn day. And here is the main thoroughfare through St. Ives. It's rather bustling with people on this autumn day. The next five minutes of footage captures the atmosphere of the promenade.
some more of those nice alleyways. It seems the last trinkets of summer in England leave by way of St. Ives. It's time for the Tate. <laughs> the quintessential Picasso looking rather cubic. The gallery is relatively small with a handful of rooms, but then again it is St. Ives and not London. Little bit of an autofocus problem there. Note to self, don't forget to lock focus. Where would a modern art gallery be without a Picasso or Miro? One of the most interesting aspects of the visit is the front facade, which is rather relaxing on reflection. Well, some bird is trying to grab my attention. Traditional Cornish stonework there. Well, that is the end of a beautiful day in St. Ives, and I hope you enjoyed it.